thought we finished well enough to uh, feel good about our performance tonight. So what did you think about Andrew's game as a whole and the tip in? Very young and Andrew to get on the boards all night, but um, <laughs> he did an appropriate moment. He, you know, their their team uh, it really begs the fact that you want to get the ball inside because they're a little bit smaller. We'll play small at that, those positions in front, and, and so you know it, it's, it takes an exercise to get the ball in there. But we were we were willing to do that tonight, and um, you put the ball inside. Is that twofold? Is that Andrew being aggressive and getting into the ball at the same time? Both. Uh, you know, I, th I think it was um, you know an act of uh, you know trying to execute in a situation which we felt like they were uh, you know opening it up. Powell was looking for him uh, early on. You know, I thought it took away from some of his aggressiveness tonight, shooting the ball and just being conscious of being aggressive uh, offensively. But uh, yeah, it was you know getting the ball in there. But you know the other aspect is is that when you look down there at the points in the paint, you know they outscored us by two, you know, which is ironic in a way. And we ended up with more three pointers. So Bill Fish uh, had a double double. He played pretty well. But he played 42 minutes, which I know is more than you want him to. So you know, as a coach, you look at that as a as a successful night for him, or point you not playing that much. Well, we don't have a back-to-back, -back. you know, that'll be something we'll have to watch on Tuesday, Wednesday to, to complete that trip down there. If we're going to be successful, we can't do that all the time. You know, Andrew, Andrew's not somebody that's not a very emotional player. After the tip in, he seemed to bounce all the way back down court, slapping the hands, loving just to everybody. What's your take on him finally showing, you know, some emotion? Yeah. Great. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> you win with uh, with Kobe shooting five for fourteen and Powell shooting four for fifteen. I yeah. mean, two top scorers. Are Both the uh, first half and second half, yeah. they didn't uh, really get rolling. And you have to hand it to Miami's defense; they really wanted to shut you know, those two players down and did. Was, was it your plan to go after to have Kobe go after Wade like like he did in the, in the he was last not, seven minutes? He was much more aggressive. Well, obviously, you know, uh, they wanted to. Time and so Kobe's on the bench, uh, getting some rest and bringing Wade back to um, attack without you know Kobe on the floor. And both times I hesitated to play Kobe too many minutes um, in the course of the game because he was working really hard defensively. I thought, and that's where he, he felt you know I I felt also that we had to really be aggressive in that particular aspect. So, you know, I held on as long as possible before putting him back in the front corner so that he could finish that game. Phil, is Miami better than their record, or do they just play you guys uh, particularly tough, do you think? You know, you know this is an over 500 team. I mean, you know, you can't uh, you know, talk about it. I mean, Indiana's better than their record, I'll tell you that. <laughs> but, you know, this team's too over 500, and, you know, they're playing, they're, they're having a nice season. They, they were, what were they last year, 15 wins or something, you know? So they've already surpass that this year they have to be really happy with their play hard. What were your thoughts on that yesterday tonight? Buddy was a you know game winner for us out there tonight. You know he did something offensively that you know gave them momentum in the fourth quarter, but he was out of position a little bit and playing a I guess it was on the end of the third quarter that kinda of got them back in the ball game that you know we wanted to avoid having to do. He played thirty one minutes about Trevor fourteen are those is it, can you call those up for grabs? Minutes based on. No, Trevor, Trevor had a nightmare out there tonight. I had not a nightmare, but I mean, you know, three travels and, you know, just, you know, everything was stymied and, you know, playing Wade and not having success with Wade. And, you know, those are tough. Those are a tough night for, for him and it affected him. And I knew Vladi was, uh, you know, feeling good about his game. But, you know, normally, you know, Trevor, those minutes are going to be maybe flip flop in you know, any situation. Trevor's going to be an influential person on the floor. Well, this is a tough back-to-back. -back. It's, it's two good teams on consecutive nights. Uh -huh. what's, what's the most important thing you think to get a good Win game? the first one. Just go out there and win the first game and let, you know, let the chips fall where they may in the second night.